this figure series was a bit uh, not very easy i would say to understand the logic so uh, anybody got this one correct in the examination what should come in the next figure in the given series what is the logic that is followed here can anyone tell me yeah chinnu says skipped yes this was a bit uh, difficult to get uh, see what is happening here is uh, if you are looking at the upper row elements right these two elements are rotating by 90 degree in the anti clockwise direction okay now these two elements rotate by 90 degree in the anti clockwise direction and after they rotate what they are happening is these two elements on top are going to the bottom yes so the top two elements they rotate by 90 degree 90 degree anti-clockwise and then what they do is they just go to the bottom now when you look at the bottom elements what happens is they rotate by 90 degree in the clockwise direction and they go diagonally to the two other sides like for example let me just uh, show you this particular figure how it is coming okay see you have this like this right this this is the first uh, first figure that you have so and this triangle is like this and then you have an arrow like this so what is happening to this top whatever is there on top no it is rotating 90 degree anti-clockwise so it is rotating in this direction so 90 degree anti-clockwise means it will become like this and then this one also it has to rotate 90 degree uh, anti-clockwise so it will become it has to go in this direction 90 degree it will become like this and then what happens these two are coming down so in the next step if you see these two figures after rotation they are coming down and it is becoming like this that's what we have got here now when you look at these two right this what happens is they rotate 90 degree clockwise that means clockwise means in this direction so this triangle will become like this this one will become like this right it will rotate 90 degree clockwise means it will become like this now once it has become like this what they do is they move diagonally to the opposite direction so this triangle will come here it was on this side no earlier it will come here and this arrow from here it will go here so that is how you get this answer okay so by going this way the correct answer that would come here will be answer figure 2 that is option 2 okay yes so if it is like this 90 degree anti-clockwise it will become like this similarly here if it is like this 90 degree anti-clockwise it has to go that side yeah so these two are like that now here again it has to rotate 90 degree clockwise this also has to rotate 90 degree clockwise and they will move diagonally so the correct answer is option two yeah actually option two and option three only this one is different right everything else is the same so this is don't mark option three it is option two because this direction of this figure is it should be like this not like this find the next in the series so there's a figure series question figure series based question we have to find out what comes next what comes here if this is the sequence, what comes next? Now observe the position of the circle. The circle was here, right? What happened? From 1 to 2 to 3 to 4 to 5. How did it move? Right? Here's the circle. Try to gauge the movement of the circle, right? So what happened from 1 to 2? It came in this box, right? 1, 2, 3. It moved 3 positions clockwise. Right? It jumped into this box. It, it kind of moved 3 sections clockwise now from 2 to 3 what happened it was here it came back here you see so it, it went two positions anti-clockwise two positions anti-clockwise yes or no from 2 to 3 from 1 to 2 it moved three positions clockwise from 2 to 3 it moved two positions anti-clockwise again from 3 to 4 if you observe it moved three positions clockwise 1 2 3 it, it came in this side you see this section so three positions clockwise from 4 to 5 two positions anti-clockwise Two position anti-clockwise. How is it easy? One and two. It, it came in this section. So from five to six, it should move three positions clockwise. Right? So if, if I draw the box here and do this, whatever coordinates are made, it should move three positions clockwise. So it was here, right? One, two, three. It will come here. In the bottom right part. Bottom right part. In the bottom triangle, right part. So see which, which figure has got that one this is eliminated 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 here option 5 is the answer